A Rio Rancho man is dedicating the next six months to helping Ukrainian refugees in Poland. He's heading to Warsaw tomorrow and he's bringing along a lot of baggage, literally thanks to his neighbors. Julie Frendek met with him today before his journey overseas. So Julie, what are his plans? Well, Tommy, this is not a small trip for this guy. He has a three leg journey to get there, but says every mile will be worth it if it means he gets to help Ukrainians in need. Eric Rajunas has been working on his plan to help Ukrainians since the first attack on the country exactly one month ago. I was ready to help as soon as like everything started. Do you have any more toothpaste? But his plans to bring along bags full of supplies only came about this week. His mom posted on Nextdoor with a call to her neighbors for help. It was Sunday night that she posted it. Majority of these were given to us on Monday. Uh, Monday and Tuesday. Come Thursday, the family's kitchen and dining room was filled with donations. I understand that not everyone can uh, go over there like me, but um, everyone does want to do their part, and that part is uh, donating these items. He'll be working with Solid Rock Mission out of Washington. It's a Christian nonprofit that does humanitarian work. They have a station at Poland's border with Ukraine. I'm excited. I. Uh, I'm ready. Because this mission means more than his generous neighbors might think. Ukraine is his home country. His parents adopted him and his three siblings from an orphanage there in 2001. He was just six when he came to the United States. I didn't realize this until I got older too, like how fortunate my family was, my siblings, to uh, come from nothing to here. That feeling is fueling his desire to help Ukrainians who need it. Being back there twice, I remember that there was this one day we went back to the orphanage and there was these kids sitting on a bench and talking to themselves and I just thinking that was me one day. So just it's all about giving back. Eric can only take along four bags on this trip, but the family was actually able to fill nine. So tonight they're asking if anyone is traveling to Poland in coming days or weeks and you're willing to take along an extra bag, we'll share the family's contact information on our website under four links. Tommy. One of the many great ways to help. Uh, Julie, thank you.